Hello everyone, my name is Dodu and welcome to the channel. And welcome to Valheim, an amazing action RPG survival multiplayer game that just came out on Steam about a week and a half ago. It is amazing guys. If you haven't picked it up, you should do it. You'll love it. You'll play it for hours and hours. And then even when you're not playing it, you're just thinking about playing it and slowly slowly progressing as you figure out what the next resource is and then that's all you want to do that's all you want to do Ugh. whoa sorry about that anyways it's a really fun game if you haven't tried it go ahead and check it out it's super fun but today i wanted to do a boss battle guide on ichthyr the first boss in the game so i just want to go through strategies on how to beat them, and also give you my recommendations of armor set and weapons that you should use. So let's go ahead and get to it. Now to summon Ichthyr, you have to make a sacrifice at the altar. Now the item that you have to sacrifice for Ichthyr is Deer trophies. So, what you need to do is build yourself a crafting table, craft yourself a bow, craft yourself some arrows. And then proceed to shoot every deer you run into. Seriously, shoot every deer you run into. Now the neat thing about this is as you are hunting for the deer, eventually they'll drop trophies, but they'll also drop the leather you need to build the leather armor set. So it's a win-win. As you're hunting deer, you also will come across wild boar. I suggest Killing every boar you come across as well, because you will need the leather scraps. In order to make the leather armor, you need to upgrade your workbench to level two, which you use to do that. You need to build a chopping block. Now that the workbench is level 2, you can make your leather armor. Let's go ahead and craft your leather helmet. Craft the tunic. And then finally the pants. And then to equip your new armor, you just right click on it in your inventory menu. Now you're all set with the armor. Now let's talk about the weapons that you will need to fight Ichthyr. The main important thing you need is a shield, the wooden shield. So make one. And then as far as weapon, you can use whichever one you want. The, the flintstone axe or the spear. Either one work really well. For fighting Ichthyr. So whichever skill is higher, go with that. Now before you fight him, you want to get the rested uh, buff. You need to do that by going to sleep at night or just staying in your house until you get it. And then you want to eat a nice hearty meal. I suggest cooked meat, grilled necktail, and then either the mushrooms or raspberries that you find. And this, what this does is it increases your health and also increases your stamina bar, which will definitely help you in the fight. So now you're ready. So we will now sacrifice the deer trophies on the altar and summon Ichthyr. There he is. Whoa! 
he came out swinging. <laughs> now the fight with Ichthyr is pretty straightforward. Ichthyr has three uh, different attacks that he uses. There is his standard attack, which you just saw there. He'll rear his head down and then strike upwards. He also has a ranged attack where he shoots lightning in a straight line in the direction that he's facing. And then Ichthyr's final attack is an AoE stomp. Each one of these has a pretty big tail, so it's really easy to see when he's gonna attack and also what the attack is gonna be. Now the really good news is that with the wooden shield, you can block all of these attacks and not take any damage at all. So when you see Ichthyr rearing his head, jumping up on his hind legs, just go ahead and hold that block button and you will be perfectly fine. Now in Valheim, there's a parry, parry mechanic where if you time your block just right with the enemy's attack, you can parry them and stun them, which will then let you do extra damage. The, that mechanic doesn't work on Ichthyr, so don't worry about trying to time your block perfectly with his attack. Just hold that block button, block the attack, and then go swinging. The only danger in this fight is trying to be greedy and get too many hits in. Uh, you've noticed in this fight I got greedy a little bit and tried to get an extra hit and then he was able to hit me before I could fully block. And the other worry about the fight is uh, using up all of your stamina. You always wanna leave a little bit so that you can block an attack and then follow up with your own. But just take your time, slowly whittle him down, block his attacks, and you will be perfectly fine. And when you defeat Ichthyr, he drops two items. He drops hard antlers, and then he drops his trophy. The antlers are important because they let you build a pickaxe, which you need in order to mine uh, ore in the game, which is how you progress. And then he also drops his own trophy. Now the trophy is what we want to look at here. If you go back to where you first spawned in, the sacrificial circle, and you put the trophy, you hang it up and then you activate it, you will get the power of Ichthyr, which reduces the stamina you use when you run, jump, and swim for five minutes. It's a really awesome buff, so use it often. But there you go, guys. That is how you beat Ichthyr. So thank you so much for watching. Have a good one.